This animation is brought to you by the Nucleus Medical Art Library, or NMAL, where you can download this animation and thousands of medical images and videos created by Nucleus Medical Media. To apply for a free 30-day trial, click on the link in the description. Your paranasal sinuses are air-filled spaces in the bones around your nose. They are connected to the inside of your nose through small passageways. A thin layer of tissue called nasal mucosa lines the inside of your nose and your sinuses. This tissue makes a thick and slippery fluid called mucus. Mucus keeps your nose from drying out, moistens the air you breathe, and protects against germs, dust, and pollen. When your sinuses are healthy, mucus can drain freely out of your nose. Sometimes, your mucosa may become swollen and inflamed, causing your sinuses to be blocked. The blockage can trap mucus inside your sinuses. If this condition lasts more than three months, it's called chronic sinusitis. If medication or other treatments aren't helping, your healthcare provider may advise you to have surgery. Endoscopic sinus surgery is the most common procedure for chronic sinusitis. To start, the surgeon will insert a camera on the end of a thin tool, called an endoscope, into your nose. Images from the camera will be sent to a video screen so that your surgeon can see the inside of your nose. Then your surgeon will look for and remove anything that blocks the opening to your sinuses. This will allow mucus to drain from your sinuses and improve airflow. After the procedure, you may have nasal bandages for a few days. Your healthcare provider will ask you to use a saline rinse to help you recover. Talk to your healthcare provider to find out more about endoscopic sinus surgery.